Turkey's Bayraktar Kizi Elma Unmanned Combat Aerial Vehicle UCAV, has marked a significant advancement in aviation technology by successfully conducting the world's first fully autonomous close formation flight involving two jet-powered unmanned fighter aircraft with no human intervention in the coordinated maneuvers. The test involved the PT-3 and PT-5 prototypes of the Bayraktar Kazelma carried out at the Akinci Flight Training and Test Center in Korlu, northwestern Turkey. A. The flight utilized intelligent fleet algorithms and an autonomous combat pilot system developed by Baykar's engineering team. The two aircraft took off sequentially and, once airborne, coordinated their movements through onboard autonomous systems to maintain precise relative positions in formation. This technological progress shifts complex aerial operations previously exclusive to manned fighter jets toward fully autonomous platforms. The capability enables multiple unmanned systems to execute joint missions under a designated leader, while autonomously adjusting positions relative to one another. During the test flight, the Kizilelma prototypes also performed a Combat Air Patrol CAP, mission, a core element of modern air warfare. The unmanned fighters followed a predefined patrol route using fleet autonomy software, demonstrating the viability of conducting air defense operations with domestically produced unmanned fighter formations. Such patrol and interception missions, typically performed by manned jets to protect designated airspace, could in the future be carried out autonomously by Kezilelma fleets. Biker's development team closely monitored the autonomous systems and operational coordination throughout the testing process. This formation flight represents the latest enhancement to the ongoing development of the Kizilelma platform. On November 30th, the aircraft made global aviation history as the first unmanned fighter to destroy a jet-powered aerial target using a beyond-visual-range air-to-air missile. Operating off the coast of Sinop, the Kizilelma engaged a target detected by the domestically produced Murad A. Saradar from ASEL SAN, firing a Goktugan missile developed by Tubitok Sage. Baykar has developed the Kizil Elma entirely with its own resources, and the Smart Fleet Autonomy Infrastructure will continue to evolve to support coordinated operations across various platforms. With advanced Smart Fleet Autonomy, future Kizilalma fleets could operate as coordinated swarms without direct human control, with one aircraft serving as the leader while others adjust positions in real time. This opens possibilities for high-risk missions such as penetrating enemy air defenses without endangering pilots. Selchuk Bayraktar, Baikar's chief technology officer, has frequently highlighted that the Kizilelma is intended to serve as a loyal wingman for manned aircraft, such as Turkey's national fifth-generation fighter, the TF Can. This manned-unmanned teaming concept is regarded as central to 21st century air warfare. Today's achievement is not an endpoint, but the beginning of a new era in which intelligent machines dominate the skies.